Okay, I think I used the word fuck too many times in the last episode. I'm sorry about that for those of you who are minors, but sometimes a spirit break will uh, make you say that. And uh, I, as I said, I was getting ready for, for MomaCon when I made this episode, and uh, anytime I get ready to go to an anime convention, I get pretty pretty hyper. Okay, so. Alright, back to Final Fantasy 10 2. We did the little spirit break thing on the last episode. Uh, I'm going to do a little, I'm going to do some small missions in this episode. And then I'm gonna um, go back to the um, to the PR missus so I can go ahead and uh, take care of that. All right. Now, uh, according to my guide here, uh, it's possible to get a treasure hunter garment grid from uh, Shimmer in the spirit break thing. I don't know if I missed my one and only chance to get it, so I think you can uh, battle Shimmer again in um, spirit break if you want to or something like that. I don't know, but if you can, uh, let me know because the uh, apparently the treasure hunter garment grid allows you to. Um, to, to do mug while you're attacking, that's very, very helpful. Okay. So, if I can do that, I will get it on this episode probably. But for now, let's just move along. We're gonna go to the medium high road and, and do this little mocking thing right now. Let's see. Uh, oh, there's something I forgot to do. Uh, I've already rested, but uh, I forgot to uh, check the treasures down here because remember that you have to rest at the beginning of, well, not the beginning, you have to rest these one, at least one time in uh, every chapter. But you can always uh, come down here to the engine room and get new items, cause uh, for some reason, every treasure chest in the game responds at the in the, each uh, different chapter. So just uh, keep that in mind when you're playing the game. Somehow they magically respawn and new items appear, like three ethers, for example. Come on, open it. Five remedies. Four high posters. Not that I need that. And six fins downs, the fins downs and, and the ethers are, are helpful, I guess. And I really hate how you have to press the other direction on the D-pad. See, look like right now I'm holding up. And it's very, very annoying. Alright, back to the bridge. As I said, uh, we're going to do this little uh, machina thing here. And then I'm going to um, do some small missions to, you know, cover up the little story completion. And then we're going to do some uh, PR stuff. Alright, so... And I really wish that they would they didn't change the music played on the bridge. I like the the first one played. Well, this one isn't isn't too bad, but I like the the first one that was played. All right. So, the Mehem High Road. Let's see what's going on here. It probably doesn't have anything to do with the temples or the fiends, but there have been problems here too. Seems some Machina are on the rampage. Let's mangle those Machina and take the reward! Yuna? We don't have time. Let's do it! <laughs> okay, sounds like it's mission time. There's that dance! Yeah, Riku, shake it, baby, shake it, yes. Alright, it's mission time. Basically, we just have to defeat all the Machina. No point in reading it, okay? Blah 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 blah. The mission went in when you're in that bad defeat to a 13 machine. This isn't a race, but you should do your best to strike them in yourself. I don't know if there's any consequences for not for not defeating all of them. I don't know exactly how this works, but basically you want to you want to defeat more more than they are bad to get something. I, I don't know the purpose of this. Uh, maybe it's to get a gummy grid or something like that. I think you still complete the mission even if even if they uh, defeat more than you will, but I don't see how they should. Looks like you'll uh, see the market on the screen. And, oh, I forgot Pain has that uh, thing on. I forgot about this uh, Dark Knight. Oh yes, I love the Dark Knight. Uh, I don't know if the, if you can simply steal from these guys and uh, destroy them like you did in the first game. If you can steal from them anyway, what do you mean I couldn't steal? Let's try that again. S-bomb. Okay. An easy one. Unfortunately, uh, it's not like the first game. Ooh, 500 spins, but not bad. 
you can't just uh, steal from them and expect to uh, defeat them. So you have to, unfortunately, reduce the hit points to zero, which is more fun anyway. And uh, let's just, yeah, looks like you'll uh, see those little green squares on the map. Those are the mocking, I believe. Yeah, come on, let's do this. Fight time! All right. Boom! Oh, I love the Dark Knight. And I was supposed to level up this thing off screen, but once again, I was so, I was, I'm so hell bent on my Super Mario RPG hack that I haven't played this since I did the Spirit Break. And as I said, Unit is surprisingly sexy as a, as a Dark Knight. I really love it. Very uh, feminine. Okay. <laughs> Moving this along, uh, let's see here. Uh, what the hell? Oh, I, I heard a little click there. Uh, the I bet uh, beat one of the uh, mocking things. Uh. Payne's doing uh, m most of the work. See how Yuna. Uh, see, see, see how Yuna stands in the uh, in the dark night. It's it's very it's something, there's something really really sexy about it. I don't know what it is, but it's something really really sexy about Yuna's uh, dark night uh, stance. Or maybe I'm just a pervert. I don't know. <laughs> uh, I've been asked by uh, by a few of my fans, uh, am I really having a fun time playing Ten Two? Because a lot of people didn't like Ten Two. Well, the thing is, it's it's much more fun when I'm LPing it than I am when I'm just you know just just playing it regularly. It's 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 it's, it's much more fun when I'm doing the LP of it than I am just you know playing it normally. So, uh, no mocking over there. I'm looking for these, uh, oh, that's the one that they destroyed, okay. Of course, uh, you can just seal your laws and, uh, let them do it for you, but I don't think you'll get anything if that happens. There's supposed to be, like, a garment grid at the end of this, at the end of this, uh, mission, I believe. They destroyed that one. There's supposed to be some more here. There's, I think there's one. Uh, come on now, give me some machines. Okay, looks like there's no random encounters here, which is a good thing, because the random encounters would definitely slow me down from uh, getting the mocking. Here we go. Is that? Is that Bixen? Not Bixen from, but Gua from Luca Goes. No problem. No problem. Impale, you missed. Give me that S bomb. Boom. Darkness. I, I forgot about this. Uh, darkness works pretty much the same way as it does in every Final Fantasy game. You basically sacrifice hit points to do massive damage to every enemy on the field. Uh, wasn't Cecil the first person to have that? Or is this uh, is this outfit pretty much based on his uh, character or whatever? But yes, as I said, the Dark Knight is definitely my favorite just fit in the entire game, and you are going to see Pain use it for a very long time. Ah, damn, they, they beat one. Might be got a big one back there. Let me just uh, spam Darkness with Yuna. One thing I love to do is, um, I learned Demi. One thing I love to do is I love to just spam Darkness while uh, Riku um, uses uh, Mega Posters and stuff like that to keep us alive, so... Yeah, Dark Knight definitely makes the main game really easy. But you're going to need a little more than that to beat those uh, side bosses in the uh, underground prevail and stuff like that. You know, so. Alright, let's keep it going. Will you shut up, Bubbles? Please, I'm doing a commentary here. I don't want you barking in my movie. Damn it. Okay. Alright, uh, a couple of sexy ladies here. Is that Shimmer? Oh yeah, he's placing those little cum spear things. There's a there's a point there's a certain point in the game where we're gonna have to view the cum spheres over and over again in order to uh, get the 100% completion. Some of them you, you can get on the first one, but there are others where you have to view it like five and ten times before you actually get somebody to come out and give you like point zero two completion or something like that. Very very aggravating. Uh, there's a give me this. Gimme! Soft? I don't need that. It'll help, but... 
All right, where are the machines? There's random encounter that slows me down. There are random encounters here. I guess I spoke too soon. Uh, I think I need to get Riku back to Alchemist so I can keep the hit points at, at bay when I'm doing this uh, darkness. Uh, while I was at Momocon, I actually uh, ran into a um, pretty cool person. Um, she cosplayed um, Thief Riku and um, and uh, Dark Maze Riku, so she's, she's pretty cool. All right, uh, let's see here. There's a Machina right there. I see the green dot, but that's uh, looks like it's on the bottom floor, and I don't want any random encounters right now. So to eliminate that muscle belt, I don't need that muscle belt. Let me put on the Charm Bagel to. Uh, uh, where the hell is it? Come on, I know I have one. There we go. Uh, I had two. Oh, that's right. I had two of them. Uh, somebody, someone noted that I already had one of these before I stole it from. Um, damn it! Before I stole it from. Uh, what's that dude name again? In the uh, New Yevon. Bear Light, Bear Light, Bear Light. Yeah, I stole it from Bear Light. But someone actually noted that I already had one. I didn't even know it. <laughs> Oh well, I guess it doesn't hurt to have two. I can sell one or whatever. Phoenix Downs. I wanted to beat more Machina than the Albert because I think if you do that, you'll uh, get your garment grade that you're trying to get for this uh, mission. Alright, let's do this. Darkness. And uh, while I'm doing that, Riku will uh, use a Mega Potion to keep our hit points at bay. Very, very simple and very broken for the main game. And did pain j just do 3,000. Yep. Oh, that was uh, after a chain hit, so yeah. Alright. How many I bet units are there anyway? I, I beat six, uh, they beat ten. I mean, I beat six, they beat four, so we beat total ten right now. Uh, is there one here? No. Go back to the bottom floor. Come on, go down. Thank you. All right, there's one right there. Hopefully, I'll get to it before they do. I'll get that church chest late. I want to get to this out bed first. And uh, uh, where the hell is it? Oh, there you are. There you are. Now that's just not right. In the first game, in the first game, we needed a chuckle boat to get up there, but now suddenly Yuna can jump up there by herself. How, how can she possibly be that agile? Oh yes, I love the Dark Knight. I wanted to save this for something special. Oof. Easy as pie. All right, we got that little mess. Dark grenade. Nice uh, spin points here. Okay. Yes, yeah, so in the first game we we needed a chokeboard together, but now Yuna just 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 sprung up there by herself. That that's just amazing. <laughs> All right, let's see. There's a safe spear right there. Don't need to use it. Uh, wasn't there another one of those Albert machines down here, or did is that the one that they already destroyed or something? Uh, there's got to be another machine down here somewhere. Yep, there's one right there, all the way down to the very end. Sneaky little bastards. You're gonna put one way down here. Okay, this. this okay, this has to be the last one. Uh, where are my grenades at? Dark grenades. Uh, ah, what the hell? Two S bombs. Ah, <laughs> pain took care of that. All right, that should be all of them. Yeah, so so there's a total of thirteen, so it's an odd number. So, all right, that wasn't too difficult. Thank you for all your help. Here's reward as promised. Ten thousand gil, very nice. So what made the machina go all haywire? 
None of us can figure it out. Pretty creepy, huh? We found agency property smashed up, then the hover crashed. Just when we were about to look into that, the Machina went out of control. Well, if you find anything out, be sure and give the Gull Wings a call. Ready to head back? Now, that wasn't a very feel-good ending, now was it? People who want happy endings have to write their own. Oh, what about me? I want a happy ending, too. I'll give you a happy ending. <laughs> Mission complete. All right, the Undying Storm of Gamma Grid. Let's uh, check it out. Excuse me for a minute, please. All right, sorry about the little interruption. Let's get back to the game. Uh, what did I get? I got a Garmin, I got a new Garmin Grid. Let's check it. I see a custom. Oh, okay. Basically, uh. It's strong. It's strong than, than what I got on the bum rust. So uh, let's uh, put that to you, shall we? Uh, what am I using? Gunner, alchemist. Okay, gunner and thief. Uh, what the hell? I uh, got gunner here. And uh, and you know what? You know what, guys? Uh, I'm gonna put this to. The, I've never used used this before, but I've been told that it's streaming. It's, it's extremely, extremely good and very broken. So I'm going to test it out. Uh, Gunner Dark Knight. Uh, I gotta have a black maze so I can uh, use the um, guy black maze. I forgot all about this uh, late luck thing. So you know what? I'm going to put it to the test to see exactly what it can do because I've never used it before. I've never used a late luck just for since this game came out. So, you're going to see me use this thing for the very, very, very first time. I don't know anything about this uh, Lady Luck Just Fear. If it turns out to be a stream broken, then I'll uh, dig into it and learn just about everything there is about it. But for now, we are going to go back to the Mushroom Rock. To take care of this little small story completion here. Let's uh, go. Let's see. Uh, mushroom Rock is uh, it's a hot spot. Why is it a hot spot? Oh, because of the... Um, because of the because of Jose Temple, that's why. Because uh, that's where one of the aeons are and things. We'll deal with that later. Not right now. And once again, Shimmer Pasta. Every time you uh, come to go somewhere at this point in the game, you'll occasionally, you'll occasionally see a Shimmer pop out. He's uh, placing a con sphere, and you have to look at that thing uh, later on in the game to get story completion. Unfortunately. Uh. Gull wings here. Where are the fiends? No need for concern, Lady Yuna. Everything's under control. The fiends got close to our headquarters, but thankfully no further. The Albed from Jose assisted us in fighting them off. So, Gibble was here? Yes, his group also brought us these Machina. You know, he said something which still strikes me as sort of odd. He told us not to depend on you so much, Lady Yuna. Me? He said we need to rely on our own strength to defend Spira through the coming age. Lady Yuna, if I may interrupt, there is something I would like to ask you. Sure. As you are probably aware, we have not heard from Maven Nuge, our leader, in some time. Lady Yuna, have you no information as to his whereabouts? I'm sorry, but we don't know any more than you do. I see. If we see him, we'll tell him to return here. Thank you. Well, I know exactly where he is, but we'll deal with that uh, later, much later on in the uh, in the chapter. Uh, looks like uh, I can't go to the place where I fight the fiends here because it's being blocked by that machina. Let's uh, go up here. Uh, uh, let me take this phone call. Give me a minute, please. Just a few more payments and I'll be done with those Renaissance really ambassadors and I, I won't have to worry about them calling me every Saturday talking about some Hey man, you know your bill due day. I've been paying the bill for a whole year. I know my bills due every Saturday. You don't have to call me. I will pay you. Damn, okay. Uh, looks like there's anything to do here in this. Uh, oh, to get this. 
Uh, in the first game, uh, this is where you get Owen's uh, ultimate weapon. There's only 2,000 gear here, so well, I guess a little bit helps. Uh, what was I saying before I got interrupted by my phone call? I can't remember. Mm. Oh well. Uh, as I say, I know what news is. Uh, that's a side mission that I don't think you have to do. But you'll learn more about pain if you do that. So, uh, yeah, we yeah we can't go through here. So let's just uh, go back to the bridge, I guess. Uh, that uh, conversation with the uh, Yabel and Lucille is naturally needed for the 100% completion. So this is why I did it. All right. Mm, mm, mm. I guess uh, this music here isn't too bad, but I still like the other one better. What they should did was uh, they should have they should have uh, had an option to uh, where we can actually choose which uh, song we hear while we're here on the uh, on the airship. That would have been nice. All right, we're gonna go back to Jose Temple. We just have to talk to Gipper here to get us a little small amount of our completion. Hey, it's it's little girl. I have a name. You seem close. We made quite the couple. Oh. You did know we choke. Okay, now I am officially jealous. Gipple, I hate your guts. <laughs> Riku's always good for a laugh. If you're here about digging, this isn't the best time. Well, there were fiends here too, right? Want us to clean up for ya? Fiend hunting? What? You guys give up the sphere gig? Temporarily. Right now, we're helping people out. Maybe you'd like to hire us? Nope. <laughs> you already took care of Sin. We can't go running to you every time we get into trouble. Hmm, I watch my own back. Hmm, show off. <laughs> well, be careful. You too. Right. Come on. Okay, I, I didn't really get this. Okay, that's needed for the story, for the story completion and that our bad primary thing. So, Gipper and Riku were once a couple. Oh, oh, Gipper, I am so gonna kill you. Alright. So, we got that out of the way. Now, we're gonna take a little trip back to Z Moon Flow. All these little, small, little 0.2% missables is just, just, just aggravating. <laughs> oh, no, I don't wanna go there yet. Alright, which way do I go again? Uh, what is it? I gotta talk, talk to that little midget who's, who, who can, who's a very good voice actor. He talks very, very, very fast. There's our little shimmer dude again. He's gonna place another, another con Okay. Alright, here we go. We gotta talk to this guy. We finally put it on a the show, of course. But there's no passion, no climax. No, 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 no. Oh, shit. Oh, shoot off. Uh, is that a nice way of saying, oh shit? Okay. <laughs> is that all I have to do? I can't run a show without climactic passion. I must have miscalculated. This wasn't supposed to happen at all. Uh, don't worry, Toby. I'm sure your next show will make up for it. Next show? How can there be a next show when the first show made the next show a no show? Well, one thing surely for sure, I need to attract celebrities to attract an audience. Huh. Got any celebrities in mind? Well, let's see, let's see the most celebrated celebrity. Eureka! Yuna, run. What's wrong? Don't ask, just run. Run now, run fast. Um, okay. Wait, 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 Keep running. <laughs> hey, what's gotten into you? Do you really need to ask? You know what he's planning, right? This is our big chance. It might be fun. 
<laughs> uh, let's go back and talk to him again. Oh, that's it? Uh, looks like you have to talk to him twice, because there are two different conversations, but the, but the guy here on GameFAQs, it, it, it doesn't say talk to him twice, so... If you have to talk to them twice uh, to get the 100%, let me know so they can uh, up update that on Game Facts. But oh well, we'll do we'll do this this little guy later on. Uh, can I do this? Th nah, that's not yeah. Okay. Pain, you're such a selfish little thing. Another thing I want to do as quick as possible is because I promised that I would do it, and I also promised that I would record it. Is I want to go back to my colonia and I want to settle my score with those uh damn blob bastards. Uh, now that I got a black maze with the uh, level three um well level two level three spells, but I think at this point in the game you'll fight a uh, a um oh I forgot a walker. Must be from Makalania Temple. The fact that it's underwater doesn't seem to matter. We can worry about why later! Yuni! We have to help them! And our fee? I'll pay you myself! How's that? <laughs> I forgot about this thing. Uh, I gotta do this a uh, walker thing right here. Uh, the fiends, uh, there's, uh, there's no time here between me. Uh, uh, oh, yeah, I have to uh, win. I have to win consecutive fights in a row, and you can't hear between them. But I can heal in the middle of the fight, and that's why I have Alchemist Riku. All right. Uh, oh, I forgot that I've, I have the Lady Luck now one. So let's just see how good this thing uh, really is. Well, apparently she's very sexy with it on. Uh, uh, looks like she she attacks with the uh, telekinesis while she has that on. Oh, does she? I didn't get a chance to see it. Cause pain took care of work. As a matter of fact, uh, oh, that's right. I can either fight or flee. Okay, Lady looks looks very very sexy. Uh, let's see. Oh, she attacks by throwing cards. Okay, uh, gamut. All right, uh, attack reels. Attack reels. You're not Walker. Okay, I got a feeling that this is gonna be a lot harder to do than it was in the first game. Eject. Okay. <laughs> okay, she just uh, vanquished him in one turn. All right. Uh, hmm. All right. Let's see what we got here. Oh, uh, that lady look looks very, very sexy. I like it. All right. Uh, let's see here. Uh, oh yeah. I Damn it, pain. <laughs> I've been told that uh, you can actually pause the reels. Just like you can in uh, Final Fantasy 7. In Final Fantasy 7, um, Tifa's uh, slots and Cat Sif's slots, you, you can actually pause the reels, which makes uh, doing your your limit break a lot easier. Let me see. How do you pause? Oh. With the pause button, I see. Okay. With the pause button, uh. Two chairs and three swords, uh. Oh, I see. You have to land it in. I don't know exactly how this late look thing works. Clean slate? What was that? If Pain would let me see how it works, I can <laughs> try it out. But I forgot she's in Prim Berserk and I can't change my equipment in the middle of this uh, secret series. Alright. Gambo, let's see what we got here. It's called Attack Reel, so I'm assuming that, that she gains uh, other stuff as she levels up. The bill points and so on and so forth. Damn it, pain! You, pain just, just, just said, uh, I got this. <laughs> let me, let me just see if I can do something before pain kills it. Make a potion. Pain killed you again? <laughs> uh, isn't Yuna... That's the last of them? 
How are the people inside? Let's go look. Is it you know uh, using uh, one of those fans like uh, LeBlanc has in uh, LeBlanc's? Yeah, I've been told that um that LeBlanc's uh, outfit is actually a uh, lady. Look, Pride of the Sword Garment Grid. Uh, doesn't that thing? I know what that thing does. It gives me the warrior abilities when when, when I have it on. <gasps> Don't talk. Save your strength. The Godric. If we did in Dramiga. You scored the Berserker Jesfri. Oh, okay. You get the Berserker Jesfri. I forgot about that. Berserker Jesfri is. Ah, what's happened to me shop? Come on, lad. I've come to give back the money I owe ye. You can't die before I pay ye back. Think of me reputation. <laughs> I'm begging ye. Oh, now look what you've done! Disgrace! Disgrace on your walker name! So we pay you back your debt and suddenly the guy dies. Okay. Now, uh, Berserker, uh, just fit, as you would expect, is, um, pretty much just all physical. Uh, what is that damn thing? Yeah, right, it's, it's, it's a pretty good just fit. They are, they are attacked with sheer brute force, but we'll use uh, that thing later. For now, let's check out this uh, Lady Luck thing. Yeah, let's see. Uh, okay, attack reels. Bribe, uh, bribe, okay, I know what that does. Um, okay, attack reels. Magic reels. Luck. Uh, raise your luck. Okay, tantalize. If it confuses our enemies, though. What? Double the space points? Okay. Um, let's learn that. So there's a triple spin point down here too. All right. I think I'm gonna be using this for a while. All right. Let's see how Walker's holding up here. How could you do this to me? Uh, that's it. Um. So what? Well, I gotta come back here later on. Oh well, I'll do that later. For now, let me. Uh, first thing I'm gonna do is uh, take off this uh, dark, take off this um, bloodlust off of pain, so I can. Uh, so you uh, can have some fun. Uh. Oh, here we go. We have to leave then. You'll get more fiends than customers. Then I'll just have to start selling to fiends. Well done. <laughs> I owe it to those lads who died defending me shop, and I'll not be letting them down. Ye will come and stop in once in a while, won't ye? Okay, naturally, uh, you won't get this scene uh, unless you uh, pay back his debt by now. So, uh, what this does is it lets him um, sell some pretty good stuff later on in the game naturally just like it did in the first game So we'll deal with that later For now, I gotta score and sell these block bastards. Let me see if I can find one And I want to see what else this uh, lay luck just for can do because I've been told that it's, it's, it's extremely broken and The fact that I can increase my spins points is the sole reason why I'm gonna use it for a while As I said, th this is my first time using the lay luck just for I was so uh, hyped on my uh, Dark Knight when I first played this game, and I never used Lay Luck for it. Oh, I forgot I'm wearing the. <sighs> I forgot I'm wearing the Charm Bagel. Well, let's just change it with the Lure Bracer. There we go. And if I take so much as two or three steps, there we go. Random battle. All right. It's a Chocobo! And it's going to kick me now, right? Oh, it ran away, damn. I need to uh, put my greens in front so I can uh, have time to catch that thing before it runs away. Next time I encounter one, I forgot about that. I have to uh, catch a chocobo before the end of this chat, I believe, to uh, actually um, get the one percent completion. Something. Anyway. All right, let's see what we got here. Uh, hmm. R. 
Yes, you can uh, stop the reels just like you could in the in goddamn in Final Fantasy 7 with the with the stop button. And stuff. Ow! You drained on my magic points, you fucking. Clean slate. What does that do? What does clean slate do? I don't see what it does. Is she like invincible or something? Magicide. What did that do? Looks like I did something. I did something that reduced the hit points. Uh, I'm probably gonna have to. Uh, okay. Oh, is, is that one of those uh, uh, all right, real things? Uh, ah, damn it, Mister. This guy's annoying with those uh, magic point drain. I mean, I kill him when I get ready. I'm just uh, testing out this uh, this uh, late luck thing here. I kill him anytime I get ready, of course. Three cherries. Uh. I'll learn uh, more about the late luck later on, but right now I want to find that blob and settle my score with it. Let me just uh, dispose of these guys here. I'm on a roll. I'm on a roll. Oh, yeah. What the hell? There's a machina here. Watcher. Oh yeah, I forgot about that. What exactly do these uh, Watcher things do? Is it, uh, they start appearing at, at this point in the game, but what exactly do they do? Really? What, what do they do? Hmm, nice. You! Now then, where were we? Let's see here. Hmm. All right. Uh, first thing I'm gonna do is see if I can get my uh, get a shell up. First thing I'm gonna do. He's doing fire, so he's weak to ice. Let's see, Blizzard Rock. That's gonna be aggravating. All right. Now we getting somewhere. Well, you dead already? Oh, you have 999 hit points. The other one has 9,999. That was it? I could have killed you before if you, if, you, if, you, if you got that much. I don't know. But I really wanted to settle my score with this thing because I couldn't beat it before. Bastard. And I got a blue ring, okay. Alright, we got that out of the way. Now let's go back to Lady Luck. Yeah. Oh yeah, I forgot. Uh, pr Pride of the... What was it called again? Uh, Pride of the Sword. Equipment. Use sword play abilities. What this does is it lets you, it lets you use your... Um, your um, your war abilities. So I can put a... I, I can put a... I can put a Dark Knight on this thing. Uh, alchemist, a uh, gunner, and I can use my I can use my uh, my armor break and Excalibur sword and stuff like that. So it's it's pretty uh pretty decent, right? And let's get uh, black mage, white mage, so I can lay luck, I guess. Cause I'm definitely gonna be using that. And even Sanchez, see, I can use that for Sanchez unit, and she can still attack you if you want to level your Sanchez while still attacking. So that's you know that's just something to consider. Just thought I'd note that. Uh, gun mage? No. Uh, I need to have a thief here. Yeah, I'm just, I'm just putting a uh, random stuff there now. Okay, we can't have that. Okay, apparently, uh, Lady Luck has this, uh, this thing called dud. If you uh, get a dud, you'll. Uh, You'll attack yourself for heavy damage, and that's very, very bad, of course. But I'm pretty sure there's some kind of broken, broken attack in this uh, thing. I'll, oh shit! I'll see it eventually. I tell you, you never know when that, when that O solo pop up. 
Uh, what I got here? Oh, I, I guess you have to match something in a uh, in, in a tic-tac-toe light thing, and if you get multiple matches, you'll get like good something. I don't know exactly how this works, but I figured I'll bet you a power break. Okay. I've got that this thing's oversold, so uh, it's going to be a little tough to beat. Feet. Here comes my trump card. Mm -hmm. uh. Ah, damn, missed it. Oh, what I got here? Oh well. Nice work. Oh, okay. I got three matches right there. So what does that do? I I, I got I got three feet in the diagonal tic tac toe thing. So what's gonna happen now? Clean slate. She's still doing something. Looks like first it intimidate. What did she do? Looks like first thing she did was uh, restore her health. Then she attacked them or something. I don't know. I'm probably gonna have to to look this thing up and uh, read about it to actually learn how to use it. You again. Well, 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 well. well. You again. If this thing only has 900 hit points, I shouldn't need a uh, black mage to beat it. <laughs> what did I do there? Okay, I'm back. Uh, unfortunately, as of now, I don't know exactly how this uh, Lady Luck thing works. What I'm probably going to do is uh, I'm probably going to um, use it. Uh, where the hell am I going? I'm probably going to end up using it off screen and uh, looking it up on the internet. Okay, because I don't know exactly how it works. So for now, I'll go back to Dark Knight. I'll learn how this uh, Lay Luck thing works uh, later on. It does look pretty cool, though. Looks like there's, there's all kind of possible outcomes. Actually, you know what? No, 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 no. I can't believe I forgot that quick. I'm going to keep it. I'm going to keep it on for the sole purpose of uh, using uh, this down here. Double experience point, so I'm, I'm I am gonna keep it on. Uh, question: If all three, if all three girls have a uh, lay luck and double experience points, uh, do they stack? Cause that'd be kind of broken if it did. Holy shit! Okay, this isn't good. I got a... That's that souped up blob I was talking about. Uh, for now, I need to get rid of a... Uh, fuck this. Uh, for now, I need to get rid of one of them. I need to get rid of that small blue one for now. I'll deal with the big one later. Okay, this uh, Lady Luck thing is actually kind of sexy. But that thing has LeBlanc written all over it. Uh, what was the what was uh this thing's uh weakness again? He's using fire. He's with the ice. Okay. Uh, looks like that. What? Oh shit! That thing doesn't have fish damage. It has uh neutral damage. That's not good. Give me those magic points. Thank you. Uh, first thing I need to do is uh, get rid of this, uh, get rid of that one before it wipes me out. Okay. Cold spell coming. Cold spell coming. Let's get pain back on the feet. What? You changed the abilities on me. You son of a bitch. Ah oh boy. What the fuck, man? Every time I do something, I get knocked out instantly. If I can just get rid of one of them, I might be okay. Boom, but I can't. 
Because of that! So I purposely over level for the sole purpose of getting my revenge on that thing. Okay. Which means I have destroyed my LP. Oh, damn. But, oh well. Anyway, with this out of way, let's continue. Just another reason why the Dark Knight is my favorite dress sphere. Okay, that makes me feel so much better. And as you might have expected, uh, yes, I uh, I did my uh, auto level off screen, and I have maxed out Lady Luck for a unit and pain. So yeah, double spin points, getting there, and double items. Uh, pretty uh, broken uh, just for here. Which is why my gear looks like this. So, all right, now let's move on. Unfortunately, everything you, you just saw me do in this episode, guess what? I had to do it again because I didn't save. But don't worry, I'll do it off screen. Uh, I gotta do this mushroom rock thing again. I gotta do the me him high road thing again. I gotta go back to Jose and talk to him again. I gotta do all that over again. All because of those big blob things. But we will do that later. For now, let's get back with the PR mission. So let's go to Killikin now. I've already, I've already taken care of everybody in Bessay, so let's go to Killikin. And this is a hot spot because uh, there's a temple here. We have to fight one of the um, one of the Aeons. We'll uh, deal with that later on. Not right now. Actually, I think I'm going to get a long cutscene here with the Donna and stuff. Uh, uh, let me see here. Okay, uh, are you one of the, oh, I, I forgot, I can jump over here and get this, uh, item back here. Once again, uh, every, che every treasure chest in the game responds every, uh, every chapter, magically, so. Including, uh, this one back here. Alright. It's kind of hard to see that. Mana tablet, not bad. Not that I need it, because I have, uh, infinite elixirs in now, thanks to the alchemist. Alright, let's see here. There's a lot of people here. Exactly who am I supposed to be talking to? Okay, this is one of the marriage things too, so let's do the matchmaking first. Says here, choose the third option. She seems really excited, okay. And for this one, it says choose the second option. They seem totally pumped, okay. A 
Okay, here's one too, okay. Says here choose the to the fifth option. They seem totally pumped. Alright. Okay, this is another lady. I don't see it in this uh, guy that I'm reading on Game Facts here. That's a lady, isn't it? Yes, and I don't see a. I don't see a. Don't see a. Ah, fuck it. Okay, let's try this right here. Let's see until they pull. Okay. So I chose the right one for him, but what about her? I I I don't see a. I I don't see a I don't see the answer for this on the guy. So if anyone knows the answer for this one, let me know. I'll hold out on that one. I get it on the next episode. All right. I don't like this uh, PR mission thing. It's kind of kind of annoying. I don't like this thing already. Unfortunately, it's needed for the 100% completion, so I have to do it. And uh, go down the. Th thank you. Now I missed a gummy grid, I believe. Uh, or can I still? I found it in the woods. Of the, uh, it's called Squatman. No, I can still do it. You can get a gummy grid by doing this thing, I believe. Uh, if you, uh, if you, uh, let me know if you find your uh, squatter monkeys. If you uh, do, do this little monkey thing here, come back. She'll give you a gummy grid. So I guess I'll do that. Maybe I'll screen or maybe doing the next uh, chapter or something like that when I have to. Not next chapter, but the next uh, part when I go at, go there to take care of the Aeon and stuff like that. Oh well, uh, I got I think I got three or four of them right. Uh, once again, uh, this is one right here, but I don't see the answer to this in the guide. So I'll come back to her later. If anyone knows the answer to that one, uh, just uh, uh, let me know and I'll come back and get it on the, on the next part, okay? But for now, we're going to get out of here. Alright, now let's go pay another visit to LeBlanc Love and let's see how she's holding up with Nuji Wuji disappeared. Okay. Let's go back to Guato Salam. Actually, uh, there's pretty much nothing here but a bunch of talking, so. I heard Shimmer again. He's gonna place the Kong Sphere down here. Let's go check on LeBlanc, love. The boss is streaming a foul move. You better steer clear for now. Uh, you're not gonna let me in? Well, screw you. Alright, what about her two henchmen? Let's see what you've got to say. LeBlanc. There's nothing to worry about. Not even close. Let's see you do it then. <clears throat> oh, LeBlanc, there's nothing to worry about. <laughs> Look who's talking! What are you doing? Oh, oi! The boss has been rather depressed since Nuge went missing. We wants to comfort her, see? Oh, was that supposed to be Nuge? That bad, was it? Yep. Oh. Even if you did sound like Nuge, do you think it would actually help? It would. Whatever you say. Well, looks like they're trying to find a way to chill the Blanc up, but uh, they suck at voice acting, so uh, I don't think that's where I want to go. Go back in. Okay. I think we have to go back to the place where we um, got the broken spear and stuff like that, if I can. Uh, can I go back down here? Oh, right here. Okay. Uh, the switch is acting up again. I can't go down there. How do I? May I gotta talk to these guys again or something? There's another door right here. Can't go down there. Damn. This is what happens when you haven't played in a long time. Alright, where you go? Okay, right here. 
I have never seen my... Okay. Well, let's see if I can uh, talk to LeBlanc now. Maybe if the little competition will help bring the boss back. Okay, so I can go in now, good. Okay, now I can go in. Okay, now I can go in. A LeBlanc love. How you holding up, baby? The gullings are gonna get all the spears and spear, you know. Fine by me. There's no point in chasing after spears if my Nuji Wuji isn't there to smile. What difference does it make? So what? Well, we're all lovey dubby now? Okay. You're a mess. Say whatever you want. Uh, like I said, uh, they're not bad guys, uh, they're more like your rivals, you know. That's pretty much it. They're, they're just your rivals, uh, they're not evil or n nothing like that, you know. Alright, with that out of the way, now we have to go back in here, I believe. Kool-Aid is good. Yeah. Why ask us? Go for it. Of course, that sphere. We took one in Bavel. Care to watch it? What's on it? We haven't looked yet. Meet us in our room. We'll have a little screaming. <laughs> Meet you in the room? Okay, that doesn't sound very, uh... Oh, well. Don't get any ideas! <laughs> Anyway, let's go back down there. I don't think we're gonna. I don't think we're gonna have any battles here. And uh, now that I think about it, uh, that cutscene uh, when uh, when we were down here, there's a cutscene in uh, in the Blanc's room, I believe, where that showed you. Yeah, you see this uh, this uh, treasure chest right here. I couldn't get before. If we can get it now, it's the Terraband. Hmm, what's that? What do we have here? What does this lovely thing do? It does uh, reduce fire, ice lightning. Hmm, well, not bad, not bad at all. That'll definitely come in handy the next time I fight those big blob bastards. Uh, now I could have swore there was a way to uh, to climb these shells or something like that and get something up top of there. I thought there was. Is this her? Sp is this her spear uh, silver finder from the first game or something? Anyway, let's get on with what we're supposed to be doing. Uh, uh, where do I go? Okay, let's get on with what we're supposed to be doing. That. Let's what? Okay, I'm pressing the right button when she's going down. Now, if I gotta, ugh, I hate that little. Nah. Let's go to these uh, guys' room and uh, see what the, they have uh, on the sphere here, or something. Only naughty girls scrounge to other people's bedrooms. Let's see. This should be it. Remember what I said uh, uh, about uh, him being a pervert in a, a couple episodes ago? <laughs> It's new! 
Watch. Hmm, what's going on here? What was he doing there? I don't like it. What? All these secrets. It's just one thing after another. If I may. You're free to do as you please, but I'd prefer you not mention this to the boss. Why not? Whatever this Vegna gun thing is, it's clearly dangerous. Nothing the likes of we sphere hunters have any business fooling around with. But if the boss knew Nuge <laughs> were involved, well, there'd be no stopping her. If anything were to happen to her. You guys got it rough, don't you? If only she noticed. I can't even get a spear. I think we have to take this back to the um, airship or something. I don't know. All right, so we got that out the way. Now let's get out of here. Uh, go out the door. Go out the. Th Why can't I go out the door? Why won't you let me go out the door? If I gotta talk to you again. I think there was one of the spheres. I want to go out the door. Let me go out of the fuck. Oh, I gotta get this. It's way over there in the corner. I, I, I mean, come on, the average person isn't gonna see that. Is this one from Bethel too? Ooh, been taking naughty pictures again. I didn't shoot this one. I found it. The image is badly deteriorated. It must be over. Ah, the only reason the war is dragging on is because Zanarkin refuses to surrender. You're wrong! <gasps> if you stop attacking, there wouldn't be a war! Who do we have here? We're not falling for that. Gah. Someday, your precious weapons will end up destroying you. It's him again! The boy who looks like Titus! And of course, you is gonna go out of her mind right about now. He's probably returning to the Machina War of a thousand years past. Oh no, 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 no! Not this whole fight again, no! The man who loves to talk, no! When did you sneak in, old man? <laughs> <laughs> Not you again! Man, how the hell did you get here? You can't expect me to remember everything that happens. <clears throat> I must admit, the likeness is positively uncanny. It can't really be him, can it? I'm afraid not, after all. That sphere was recorded a thousand years ago. Right. Of course. Hmm? Hmm. Unfortunately, <laughs> yes, you guessed it. I gotta speak to this old fart. Yes, I gotta talk to him. Let's not hear a two-hour story this time. Would you like to hear? Uh, <laughs> I'm assuming that I can't interrupt him again, so let's just sit down and listen. Lady Yuna, a rumor has been going around of late. Perhaps you've heard it. They say that High Summoner Yuna was accompanied by a guardian from, of all places, Xanakant. Oh, yes. That young man raised quite a few eyebrows at the Blitzball tournament in Luka. I spoke to him myself on a number of occasions. I could sense that he belonged to an other world. That he should look so much like the man in that sphere cannot be mere coincidence, I should think. There's a connection. There is. I would very much like the chance to ask him and clear this matter up once and for all. But he's gone. 
Just like the Faith said, our dream will vanish. A dream of the Faith? Is that right? Hmm. Oh my. What is it? Oh. I had something on the tip of my tongue, but then it slipped away. Something very important. Oh. Frustrating. Well, I suppose I'll just have to think on it a little more. Until next time, Lady Yuna. We are all connected. There may yet be a way to reunite with those who have gone. What? Watch what you say. Forgive me. Consider it the ramblings of an old man. Well, apparently this old man knows a lot. He said there may be a way to reunite. Okay, we'll deal with that later. But for now, let's finally get out of here. Okay. Let's get out, 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 out! Alright. We'll do this. We'll do this the fast way. Okay, according to the guide here, I'm supposed to be uh, watching this sphere that I picked up in Guasalum, but I watched it while I was in Guasalum, so I might have done something wrong. I don't know. Uh, the con sphere, okay. I might have uh, done something wrong if I did, uh, let me know, but I will. We'll do that later. For now, let's take care of some more small stuff. Let's go to the Thunder Plains. Let's go. <clears throat> and I guess I'll do a few battles here to see how the monsters have uh, leveled up here. Well, actually, they're under level because I, I, I've completely destroyed my LP now. Because as you see, I'm at level 66 between 82. And uh, because of that, that damn blob thing, so yes, I've completely ruined my LP. But don't worry, it's, it'll get much tougher once I get to the uh, Bavale Underground. Because those guys are tough regardless of uh, what level you're at. Unless you have um, catnip and you, you can constantly keep hit points in caution mode, then you can hit them off for 9,000 every time. Alright, we're looking for those little pint sized run souls. Uh, do I have the uh, Charm Bagelon? Yes, I do. Okay, I don't want that thing on. Uh. Come on, where is it? Don't try. Uh, oh, Yuna's wearing it, isn't she? Okay. Uh, I guess I put that on. It might help. Bloodlust. Ribbon. Took off this uh, no tie ring. I don't need that now. I had that for the uh, for those fucking blob things in uh, Macalania. Uh oh, X must spot. We're already there. Cool. And what is this little watcher thing that appears at this point in the game? What is this? But yeah, I've I've completed this over level now completely. So yeah, pretty much most of these uh, normal battles are just, just going to be a complete waste of my time now, unfortunately. But most people who play this game do that anyway, because uh, there's really no reason not to, because it's so easy to do it. So X must spots. Uh, are you still bummed out about that, pops? Who asked you? Let's go. Yuna! I'm sorry. Can you forgive me? Well, uh, that wasn't in the guide, but uh, I'm pretty sure you have to watch that to uh, get the 100% completion. If you don't, let me know. Alright, what do we have here? Die! You're not dead? Alright. There we go. That one was pretty tough. He's got a lot of defense and light curtain. I need a lot of those to mix the um, mighty guard thing. So it might not be a bad idea to come here and get a couple of those. Matter of fact, I might stock up on that. This thing again? Got that right. Die! 5,000, wow. Yep, I've uh, made the main game extremely easy now. At, at this point, I can just streak through the main game, seriously. The only enemy that might give me trouble is um, a mega weapon and that um, 
that big guardian thing at the end of the game um, if you uh, try to go to the final level without um, solving the puzzle you have to fight 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 this big uh, dragon thing and he's uh, pretty tough after you beat it in the main game it, it'll start appearing in the uh, underground prevail started recording this, the episode that you're currently watching I started recording it at noon and it's now one o'clock in the morning I was going to originally get this damn thing uploaded but those blobs pissed me off so that's why it's late sorry about that and we have three lizards here who really want to die oh shit that's a dud that's a dud uh, when you get a dud you'll uh, attack yourself and, and reduce your hit points which is very bad of course so I just let Yuna do this there we go Looks like the main purpose of this uh, Lady Luck thing is to double your experience points. Because I'm, I'm really not doing good with the dice roll here. Or the slot roll, but uh, I know you can pause it. But I don't feel like it. No. Whoa, what we got here? This thing, uh, well, unfortunately I, I didn't get a chance to see what it can do because once again I'm over leveled. So, anyway. Okay. level 80 at this point in the game but nonetheless some people do indeed go to level 99 before some people actually make it to level 99 the instant that they get the white mage uh, just fear because once you get the white mage just fear you, you can auto level <laughs> so yeah I'm not the only one who does this everybody does it just die please thank you alright that's enough of this uh, two more light curtains I'll uh, probably get more of these off screen for now let's see if we can find those uh, well <sighs> it's one o'clock in the fucking morning let's see if we can find those pint size of Ronso now mm. oh, I know where they are they're, they're at the same spot where we where Yuna said she wanted to marry Seymour and stuff uh, I think I see them right there yeah there's little bastards I see you You guys better watch out. With horns like that, you're just asking to get struck. <laughs> Leon and Aid left Mountain to find a way to repair Elder Kimari's horn. We cannot return to Mountain until a way is found. And you expect to find that here? Yes. Where does Lady Yuna think we should search for a way to fix Elder's horn? Okay, now I I always pick Kilika Island because there's nothing there but wood. So using wood would be a good way to, fi to fix a horn. But according to the guy, you're supposed to pick um um Kilika Island. But I always pick this anyway. So Kilika Island. Uh, what's in Kilika? Wood. Well, uh, <laughs> just a hunch. Leon and Aid go there to look. Thank you, High Summoner. Come, Aid. There's a bunch of wood there, so uh, maybe that'll be a way to fix this one, but oh well. And uh, that's all we have to do here, so let's get out of here. Actually, you know what? I knew I missed something in uh, Gar Salaam. Now, let me just simply go back there and get it, shall I? Now, there's a guide on Game Facts that uh, tells you how to get the 100% completion. But unfortunately, uh, it does miss a few uh, small little details. Like it tells you to um, pick up the Christmas, um the Chrism Force Sphere in the uh, Gloss Alarm, but it doesn't exactly tell you how to get it. It just says pick it up. So I think it would have been better if uh, I mean it's a good guide. I'm not crabbing it, but I think it would have been better if they, if they had um, you know told you exactly how to get the sphere. Cause it just says get the sphere and watch it, but you know. For first timers or uh, whoever, they might need a little more detail. So, I'll meet you back in uh, the Blanc's room. Anyway, 
anyway, here we are now. They're supposed to be. I'm supposed to climb a. Uh, it's this one. I knew. I knew there was something in here that I could climb on. I knew I wasn't going crazy. You have to climb this thing, and you have to um, come over here, open this chest chest, and there you go. The crystal spear number four. This is what they meant right here. So you have to get this. I have to take this uh, back to the airship and watch it. This is needed for the 100% completion, unfortunately. All right, let's go back to the. Air get out. Okay, let's go back to the airship. I'll meet you there. Oh, the oh, I, I can do it right here. Okay, no need to edit it out. Okay, I feel better now. Now I know I haven't missed anything. You simply uh, take this thing here to Shinra. Come on, get. Thank you. I know everything. And now we have to watch it, of course. Let's take a look. This is the final exercise. We have reports of something extremely dangerous inside this cave, but we lack more detailed information. We're to eliminate it? No, you are simply to investigate. Report your findings back to me. Those who return here alive will become formal members of the Crimson Squad. Sir! There aren't enough weapons for all of you. Claiming a weapon for yourself will be part of this exercise. This is it, gentlemen. You have your orders. Begin! <laughs> Well, if it isn't Mr. Kinock. Okay, what the hell was that? That was kind of weird. Hmm. I guess we'll learn more about that later. And uh, that reminds me, I never actually uh, did that stuff down at, at the um, at the bottom of, of, of the mushroom rock, where you can fight Nuge and Gipple and in, in yourself and stuff like that. I never actually uh, did that before, so I guess I have to do that during this LP for the one percent completion. But unfortunately, uh, it is one o'clock in the morning, and I am kind of tired. Uh, I started this. Uh, I started recording this episode at uh, noon. I was trying to get it up by five o'clock, but unfortunately, I got delayed by those big blob things, which is why I overleveled. So yeah, so I'm sorry that the episode was late, but better late than never. So with that said, we're gonna end this episode right here. So I guess on this one, we'll do a few more small missions, one big mission, then I'll do some more PR missions. And then we'll continue on, alright? See you guys later. Take it easy.